Hey guys, in this video, we will going to cover four things. First, we will going to tell you how you can create your Google AdSense account. Then we will discuss how you can connect Google AdSense and WordPress website. Then we will teach you how you can place ads in your WordPress website. We will discuss two methods. One is auto ads method and how you can put ads manually as well. Also, we will discuss earning ad breaks issue. So when you will going to get approval from Google AdSense, you may see this issue which says earning ad breaks. So how you can solve this issue as well, we will also going to talk about this problem in this video as well. So now let's get started. Hey guys, in this video, we will going to tell you how you can add Google AdSense in your WordPress website. So if you are a blogger or if you want that your WordPress website to go monetize, then you can use Google AdSense. Right now you can see this is one of our website and here we have put so much ads. You can see this is the website business with the eye and it is our website only so you can see at very bottom we have this advertisement here also we have this advertisement so there are lots of advertisements so whenever someone will click on this ads i will going to make money okay so this is the thing i will teach you how you can connect or add google adsense to your wordpress website if you will also go to our post let's say class 12 okay so it is a website i have made for academics uh, you can see if you will click on let's say sources of business finance on this article you will going to see again the lots of ads which pop on side as well as in between my articles like this okay so this is a very great way to make money with your website or blogs okay so if you will again go and see with some others website if i will going to talk uh, with this and let me open some blogs now here also you can see ads okay right now I don't know why it is not showing so after some time uh, advertisement will also going to show to this website as well so you can also add to any of your website you just need to search on google google adsense right after you will type this just click on enter so you will see this website so just click on this first link and now you guys will come to google adsense so now when you will visit a website you will going to get option of sign in and get started so if you are very much new to google adsense click on get started otherwise if you have already signed up you can click on sign in so i will just click on get started you need to add your website url for example let's say this is my blogging website or your website wherever you want to show advertisement just copy the url of your website and paste the url here your email address and then you can click here and just click on save and continue after that it will show one option to create account so now you guys can see right now you are in google adsense okay so you have created your account successfully now if you will go to sites so right now you can see that none of your sites is enabled so you first have to click on add site you have to paste the url of your website like this and then just click on save and continue now you guys will going to see we have this adsense code which we have to put in our web, uh, wordpress website you just need to copy the code like this then just go to dashboard of your wordpress website from here just go to appearance from appearance just make sure that you click on this theme editor okay just go to appearance and click on theme editor click here i understand now you have to paste this code in between your head open tag and head close tag so to do that you just need to click on this header.php okay so whatever theme you will going to use you will see this option of header.php just click here and now here you guys will going to see one option of head open and head close so you have to place this code in between your head open and this head close so what i can do i can click here i then click on enter and here you just have to paste the code so you have to paste this code here okay so i will just click on paste now you can see this is the code of google adsense then just click on update file from down after you will do this just click on request preview so now we have successfully put our google adsense code to our wordpress website now we have connected our google adsense and our website now google adsense is verifying your website whether your website is eligible for showing ads or not so i will highly recommend that whatever website you have or whatever blogging website you have post 10 articles minimum and then only apply for adsense you can see whatever website i have for example this is one of my website if i will click on home page you can see right now i have put so much articles in my website that's the reason i have got approval for google adsense if you will also click on this post now you can see i have uploaded so much articles 
so that's the reason i have got approval in my website so similarly if you want to get approved by google adsense you have to put minimum of 10 blogs in your wordpress website so till now we can place our ads just click on ads okay okay you are very much new okay get started now you guys can see we have one option of auto ads so if you will click on this edit button from here and if you will enable auto ads now google will automatically going to show ads wherever google adsense thing so if you will enable this option friends so what will happen google adsense will automatically see in your website where he can place your advertisement okay so you can see this is my website so google can automatically place the ads here 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 so this is the auto ads it will automatically going to see where he can place advertisement and he can place the ads here so in this website business video i have used auto ads so you can see with the help of auto ads it is showing advertisement wherever google thinks that it can fit the ads okay so he, he is showing at almost every place you can also do it manually so you can decide where i want to put my ads so for example in this website i have not used auto ads if i have used auto ads so my ads could also show in between here 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 okay but i have only shown in my blog section so you can see these are the empty space for google adsense i don't know why it is not showing right now maybe because i have logged in with my personal id so it is not showing but it shows here okay in between my articles so you can also do it manually i have taught you how you can do automatic you can just click on this uh, auto ads and then just click on apply to site so when your site will going to get approved by google adsense it will automatically going to place ads in your website okay just click on save now another way is to do everything manually if you will click on buy ad unit here you can go with this recommended display ads in feed set whatever you want you can go with that i will click on display ads so you can place display ad wherever you want to for example i write it here and demo i will click on this create button here now i have got this code i i can just copy the code like this just click on this copy code snippet all the code will be copied now wherever you want to show your ads you have to paste that code there for example i'm telling you one plugin just click on plugins click on add new plugin and just search here add inserter or add insert okay you just need to search this now you guys will going to see this plugin add inserter add manager and adsense ads just click on install now by igrofuna and then click on activate now here in the plugin section you will going to see ad inserter is installed successfully and activated successfully you just need to click on settings and friends here you can see we have lots of options so wherever you want to show your advertisement you just have to paste the code for example just copy this code come here and click on paste now you can decide where you want to show your ad so here it is selected as post now i want to show in the post but where in post so you can see it is giving us option before post that means when your post will going to start so before your post it will going to show advertisement before content before paragraph after one paragraph before image after image so you want to show your ads after image so you can choose this option now for example i choose after paragraph now it is asking me at which paragraph so i want to show my ads after second paragraph okay and after you will do this just click on save settings your ads will going to show in your blog after two paragraph if you will click on two again paste the same code here which you have copied from google adsense now you can decide uh, some other actions like post now you can put uh, after content okay again click on save settings now your ads will also going to show after content that means after your blog content it will going to show again click on third place the same code now you can decide that i want to show my ads before comments okay then click on save settings now your ads will going to show before comments click on four again paste the same code now you can decide where you want to show your ads so you can choose any static page you can choose home page if you want to so whatever option you want to go with you can go with from here you can search for that option where you want to exactly show your ads in footer after comments okay so this is the thing i want to tell you so now friends if you want to show your advertisement to your blog sidebar like this so how you can do that again go to your wordpress website from appearance just click on widgets now here you guys will going to see one option of ad inserter so you can click here and you want to show to sidebar right it can show you a default sidebar or main sidebar at top you just have to click here like this now just click on done here now your ads can also show in your sidebar as well so for example right now you can see i have put one two three 
4 okay 4x you can also do that for example if i want to place the ad between search and recent post again i want one more ad inserter click on ad inserter main sidebar click on ad widget click on done now if you want to show in between your recent comments and archives so your ads will also going to show between recent comments and archives okay so now your Tax is 100% done. Now your ads will going to show in your WordPress website, but it will only going to show when Google Adsense will going to give you approval for your WordPress website. If you will click on cross, if you will go to sites, you can see still your ads is not yet approved. Okay. So in case if you get approval, so Google Adsense can show you one thing in your dashboard. If you will go to home again, or if you will uh, go to Google Adsense again. So here at top, it will going to show something like this, that earning ad rigs, you need to fix some ads.txt file issue to avoid severe impact to your revenue so you just have to click on this fix now button and then you will see this button called as download you have to download one file which google adsense will going to provide you now whatever website you have used to apply for google adsense so for example we have applied for this website called as gapagap so i can go to gapagap website here is the gapagap website here i have applied for google adsense so i will click on manage now i have to go to file manager of this website so just scroll down, scroll down, scroll down. Here you will see file manager option. Now you will come here. You just have to click on this public HTML, double click. And friends, from here you just have to upload one file. Okay, select the file. Now in downloads, you will going to get one file provided by Google AdSense. So when you will click on this download, one file will be downloaded and you will see that file in your computer download. From there, you just have to select that file and upload one file here okay so when that file will be selected you just have to click on upload so you will successfully upload that file and then this notification which uh, will show that earning at tricks it will automatically go so this was the thing i want to teach you so i have taught you how you can create google adsense account how you can connect your google adsense to your wordpress website third we have taught you how you can generate auto ads how you can put ads manually and i have also taught you about this earning at tricks issue so it may come so after you will get approval for your WordPress website, just check after two days by again login inside your Google AdSense, you may see this notification. So I have taught you how you can remove this notification as well. So hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Before we end this video, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. Click the bell icon so that you get notified whenever we upload new video. Also follow us on Instagram. You can see we have 60,000 plus followers on our Instagram page. You can also follow us on our Facebook page. You can see we have around 105,000 plus people follow our Facebook page.